Town says her whole world could have changed. Her car was stolen with two children still inside of it. Rose McBride tells us why police are warning parents to never leave their kids in an unlocked car. Wednesday afternoon, Jessica Carr made a quick stop at the Speedway on Dixie Avenue with her husband. Sometimes if we're running strapped for time, we'll just come here and he'll get something to eat. It was cold and raining, so she left her two kids, 11 year old Peyton and five year old Anastasia in the car with the heat on. I could see them. I was like 20 feet away from them. Jessica planned to return to her car and drive away, but when she got outside, the car and her kids were gone. It was terrifying. Just seconds before car left the store, police say a man stole the minivan and drove away. It was just panic. All I wanted was to get them and we were just running as fast as we could trying to catch the van. Investigators tell us the man, Frederick Reales, dropped the kids off down the street and drove the car more than 10 miles before he was stopped and arrested by Radcliffe Police on Kentucky 313. Fortunately, this didn't end worse than it, than it did. Elizabethtown Police are warning parents to never leave kids in an unlocked car. This is something that his parents Many people do on a routine basis. In fact, last December, a man in Shepherdsville allegedly stole a car with a 13 month old inside while the baby's mother was mailing a package at UPS. Carr wants to use this experience as a warning to other parents, saying you never know what could happen. Or even just to pump gas, we should lock our cars because someone could just jump right in while you're pumping. Now she says her two children are never leaving her side. In a matter of 30 seconds, my whole world could have ended. Rose McBride, WHAS 11 News.